Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to Those Nights at Rachel's. Now this is made by the same guy that made the joy of creation. So you know it's probably gonna be good and this is also made in the Unreal Engine so I don't know if it's Hello gonna be fully- welcome to your new job. Hi! And Rachel's. Hi, you we sound have excited. the best electronics and food available at the lowest prices. Oh jeez. Straight up guarantee. Uh huh. Since this is your first night at the job, we'll connect you to a live call with our colleague. Okay. He'll be your guide for the first night. Have fun. Okay. Uh, Thank you. Who am I calling? Live call. Oh God, damn it. Hi. God. Is it? Hello. Hello, hello. Hi. Are you there? Yeah. Uh, hi. Uh, you must be the new night guard. Well, uh, if that's the case, which it probably is. That I'm supposed to help you with our amazing technology. Mm. It's a bit, uh, it's a bit cheesy, but you get the point, right? No, no, I, Well, for starters, the company thinks that putting up security cameras in practically any corner is going to help. And honestly, I don't think it will with what you're going to have to deal with. Uh, but anyway, you can switch the security feed using the click of our standardized mouse that the company put out. Okay. That's one way to describe it. Oh, jeez. It's geez. really old, but uh, we'll get through it. Uh-huh. I'm... But I... uh, let me tell you, the power bill is expensive with almost every damn item. What am I looking at? So hopefully, by limiting the power, you won't be like that. <laughs> By, like who? you can track the power on the secondary monitor, and for uh, God's sakes, do not break it. I do. Honestly, I feel like I'm repeating uh. myself at this point. Power is usually measured through the closable doors in your office, which can be closed at any time using the Z and X keys. And you'll need to shut them as soon as something uh, <sighs> undesirable may appear. Uh, you probably don't know what I mean. Which, in that case, it's probably for the better. Okay. But anyway, don't leave them shut. Okay. Uh, all right, a few more things, and then I can set you on your way. All right. You actually have a spare room next to your office. Great. Which has pretty much been deserted for some time. Cool. However, we used to allow employees to go in there, but I, uh, uh mm -hmm. kind of had an accident in there. Needless to say, don't ever let those curtains open <laughs> all the way. Why not? And if you by chance actually see anything, or anyone back there, <laughs> uh, don't go to the media. Okay? Oh shit. We've oh, had shit. some rough edges in the past. Oh shit. Probably even more than I've seen myself. Oh shit. Oh but, uh, shit. Oh shit. Uh, long story short, uh, always close the curtains. Don't ever ask why either. It's just company rule. Shit, Honestly, that was a third door! <laughs> even know myself. You can walk there using the W key. Oh! Um, if an animatronic, specifically oh, a raccoon the, the and the, the, the thing the from thing. the curtains, oh, God, finds it's their two way doors. into your office, uh. you can't hide from them. Somehow they have increased awareness. Possibly some sort of, uh, developing mistake. What? Uh, it's best not to think about it too much. So, uh... Yeah! That'll set you on your way. Yeah! Oh, oh, wait, 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 one more thing. Uh, if two of our amazing animatronics somehow managed to, uh, find their way to both of your doors... What the fuck? ...we found a small trick for that. Hiding under the desk seems to actually help, and even saved my life. I mean, uh, my job. Well, yeah. it helped me save my job one time. So, uh, yeah, close the curtains, monitor the building, Oh, God. The flashlight, hide in the desk, uh. and you'll be promoted as soon as you know it. And actually, please, <laughs> yourself. We've had some issues with our reputation, and it kind of went downhill recently. Damn pizzeria down the street. Fazbear's Pizza something. Somehow, it's managed to absolutely destroy our reputation due to them having some sort of robot incident. Uh, after that discovery, animatronics may just be looked at in a different way. Yeah. Uh, it's a bit unsanitary and rude, but customers are customers. Uh -huh. We need them. We need their cash. Oh. What? Hello and welcome to your new job at Doug's and Rachel's. What? We have the best animatronics and food available at the lowest prices. Straight up guarantee. 
Wait, Since this is your first night at the job. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, what the fuck was all of that? What the fuck just happened? Wait, did I miss something here? Damn it. Doug. What the fuck? Uh, hello? Hi. Um, hi. Uh, welcome back to Doug and Rachel's and, uh, yeah, um, company didn't really want me to record any more phone calls after your first night. Okay, uh, why? Figured, why not? After all, they don't monitor the calls after the first one, so I'm safe to say whatever I want. <laughs> uh-huh. Well, for starters, which I'm sure you know by now, the animatronics are really jumpy. Uh, easiest way to say it is something like performing after hours, but with a bit more of a kick. They seem to actually move around the building, and no one knows why, actually. Uh, one of the night guards tried to do some investigating himself, with, which probably was the dumbest idea ever. Yeah, something okay. like that. It's safe to say that it didn't end particularly well. Huh. <laughs> uh, other than that, nothing really happened recently. Although I Whoa, really what the fuck that is yet. that? You're a fourth or fourth, fifth, fifth night guard right now. Um, the others being in an unnatural state. One of them even stopped talking and developed some sort of verbal communication problem. Very strange. Yeah. He had to take it to some therapist and the family tried suing us. Cool. Uh, despite all their efforts, of course it didn't work. Uh -huh. Nothing ever does. All it takes is the company's little bit of money before they just wash all the troubles away. Okay. I uh, shouldn't question it and neither should you for the sake of our job, at least. As hellish as all this may seem, you'll get through it. Almost all of us do. Well, just stop being so subtle about things, you wanky bastard. I don't know why these are still closing. That was like a million hours of conversation that I didn't need to talk about. Uh, there's so much information that they just threw at me. How am I supposed to be able to comprehend all of it? It was all wrapped up in an enigma with bullshit about how I'm gonna die. What the fuck? This is a load of bullshit. Hi! Who the fuck are you with your green glowing out last bullshit eyeballs? Ah, oh. uh, fuck you. Who the fuck is that? Oh shit, that doesn't sound good. Get the fuck out of here! And the controls! I don't know the controls yet. Why did you put away the controls? Ah! Okay. I just need to get that panic out of my system so that I was able to actually comprehend what the fuck was going on here. It's already 3 a.m. Everything seems to be bullshit and horrible. What the fuck? I, this threw me into the deep end of the pool faster than I've ever been thrown in my goddamn life. You would like, holy shit. Oh my God. Okay, so now that I'm done panicking, Let's actually try to do something about this and close these goddamn curtains, whatever the hell. It's gonna be popping out of the goddamn curtains. How am I supposed to be able to know anything? God, I can't even keep track of what's coming down the hallways. Like, I don't know. I'm missing one. One is definitely missing. One's over there, but there's another one that's missing. I don't know what's popping out of there. I had to listen to a phone call for about 10 fucking minutes, which is fine. I get, I get backstory needs to be put out there. But I don't remember, like, they were telling me hints on how to hide and when to go back, and the only thing I remember is go back to the goddamn curtains so that I can close them for some fucking reason! And then go about my goddamn life, which I don't understand fully. Oh, man. And I got the most snarky boss that ever existed in the world of fucking animatronic bullshit here. But I haven't even seen a goddamn animatronic! They're putting it out like I'm gonna die in two goddamn seconds, but nothing has attacked me! What the fuck? What was that? Hello? But I don't know, when, once this gets further in the nights, how am I supposed to be able to get all the way to the back here and be able to close this bullshit? And then go up all the way to the front? Oh shit, what was that? Sorry. I'm in just a bit of a tizzy. So I'm hoping that everything's gonna be okay. I got power to waste, so I'm pretty sure... Yeah, it's almost 6 a.m., so... Well... Alrighty then. Okay. <sighs> anyway, goodbye. So, just like that. I don't know if there was something bugged about the first night or just because the phone call went on so long, but it seemed like, it seemed to like cut him off when there was very vital information and I'm already on the third night. What the hell? That doesn't make any sense. There was like no threat yet. What the hell happened? 
I am so confused. I'm so confused. Oh boy! Don't you think taking the endoskeletons was enough? Wait, oh shit. What? Uh, hello? Uh, sorry about that. I just accidentally picked up at the wrong moment. Other than that, uh, welcome back to Rachel's, of course. By now, I'm sure you have the hang on things, so there's actually no point of rambling on. <laughs> I'm actually just surprised you've uh, lasted this long. I mean, with your job. Uh, yeah. Uh, Piggy's uh, gone. Anyways, I I've heard some news lately. Uh, uh -huh. Nothing really interesting, of course, you know, except the fact that the owner is missing, weirdly. No one has seen him anywhere in the building. A bit strange, what do you think? Uh, not that I really care, just curiosity. You know. You, uh, you want to know the worst part? We won't get promotions without him being here. I, uh, hopefully, I wish he comes back for the sake of the promotion. It's stupid to think of getting the promotion by now, though, interestingly enough. Probably due to the fact that the owner doesn't really want to be attached to the company or the mascots for some reason. Maybe he hates this place for whatever reason? Maybe as much as we do? <laughs> oh god, they're I know all I gone! Do, in many ways that you'd probably not ever imagine. Oh, this place sure does have a shady past. Uh, Alright, so I think I'm gonna call it quits now. I'll chat with you tomorrow. But see ya. Yeah, if I'm gonna be here tomorrow, they're all off the stage and I can't even find them on the fucking camera! Like, see, oh, hey, how's it going? That is nearby to me, isn't it? Oh, shit. What? That's another door? I don't even know what that door is. It's like off to the left. How do I do that? What do I do? I don't know what the fuck I do. I don't understand any of this bullshit. Ugh. Just gotta close whatever the hell this curtain is. What was that? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hi. 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 Oh, hi. Bull ass piece of crap, bull and big friends. Oh boy. They're going to hang out with the dog in the house. Or what is that, a cat? I have no idea. Oh man. Fuck me. God, what is with the curtains? What is with any of this in this game? Oh man. Oh boy. I'm gonna close at least one of these doors just because it seems like I got more than enough power to be able to last through the day. Oh, what are they doing? They're going to the raccoon's hut? Why? I did not know that was a raccoon in there, but I'll take your word for it. And this guy is getting awfully close to me. Yeah, there's three door. Oh, th that's the back room on the right there. Okay, so he's coming up the... Okay, so I I'm going to close the other door. Because, yeah, he's not coming down that way. I should probably check on the back area. Okay, that was pretty wide open. I need to be more mindful of that. Ah, jeez. Ah, jeez. Okay, he's moved. Where did he move to? Are you all pow wow? Oh, fuck me! I don't understand! I don't get it! What the hell just happened? What? I don't know! What the fuck? I don't- I have no idea. Oh, man. Okay. I'm gonna end this episode here because this is bizarre. They threw so much information so quickly, I have no idea what to do. That is, this, and what's weird is that it seemed like nothing was happening. It was very hard to get a rap on, there was so many different things to do, that it was impossible to get a grasp on anything, and yet nothing was attacking me for two nights straight! What the fuck, I don't get it, wow. Something... I need to wrap my head around this, so I'm gonna end this here. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you everybody so much for watching, and as always, I will see you in the next video.